So first, so we're gonna create a new project by clicking on the new project option right here. Then we're gonna select a cloud area right like this. We're gonna add and let's check and I'm gonna click on this video, increase the speed to 2x right here, like this. Yeah, it'll look good. Now we're gonna delete this part and my aspect ratio will be 3 by 4 right here. And now increase the size to fill the area right here like this and decrease the duration to 2.0 .0, and it kind of look like this now we're gonna add an overlay right here click on add overlay and adding this image right here you can get this image and videos link uh, videos on my telegram channel link is on the description now increase the size right this and decrease the duration to second now we're gonna find some edges open right here click on sorry click on brightness again and decrease it to let me check how where it look good uh, right here I'm gonna select 30 yes it look good on minus 30 now go to video option click on effect video effect and search here blur and select this effect right here now we're gonna go back and click on this effect click on adjust and decrease it to let me check it can look good on 14 right here click on done duplicate it object and select the image here now they both are blur right here like this now we're gonna click on add overlay and I'm gonna add a animation of Isagi right here so I'm gonna click on this here and gonna click on album add this animation right here I'm gonna crop some part of this animation click on resize and a little bit of zoom I'm gonna crop the rest part like this click on done right here now go in decrease the size and search for the chroma key right here select the blue icon here clean up images now clean up size so gonna decrease the color let me check intensity to minus 30 40 17 yes 70 gonna look good now we're gonna position it right here like this now I'm gonna decrease some duration to two second I'm gonna duplicate it again right here click on duplicate and drag it under the first animation right here now select the first animation and let me check gonna rotate it like this gonna drag it down like here like this and gonna find a crop again right here transformation mirror and gonna put it like this increase the size right here like this now we're gonna search for adjust here now search for the graph option drag this point down like this yeah it kind of look good click on brightness Sorry, situation and decrease it and decrease it also and we're gonna do let me check yeah it kind of look good right now so I'm gonna click on done and now I'm gonna click on that and search for opacity and decrease it to 64 or 65 yeah CT6 is perfect for me now let me drag like this right here now search for the video effect and search here motion blur like this click on it and click on this effect right here click on the effect object and the animation right here now click on done search for adjust horizontal to for 57 and intensity 100 horizontal must be 55 now our shadow effect is ready here now we're gonna add some overlay right now click on add overlay search for my editing materials right here I'm gonna select the photos I'm gonna add this image you can get this image on my telegram channel links are on the description click on overlay and decrease it to like it gonna look good on 40 click on done and decrease the duration also now add overlay again click on this blue image and increase it 
splice overlay and decrease it to let me check yeah increase the size right here decrease it to 35 also now decrease the duration right here now click on add overlay again we're gonna add this lens flare increase it click on blend search for light option right here decrease it also to 80 percent right here and put it like this little bit of zoom in and decrease the duration also now it kind of look good right now but i'm gonna pull the lens flare and increase the size of it like this and decrease the opacity to 66 right here it kind of look good now we're gonna add an overlay again click on album option right here click on video option we're gonna add a rain effect right here click on this and increase the size click on splice filter and let me check go to opacity option right here again search for the opacity option like this and decrease it to 64 yeah it can look good right now now we're gonna click on this and delete the rest part right here click on it search for the layer option and drag it to in front like this now it's ready here like this now this is ready guys you can change your lighting according to your need